Hey y'all and good morning. Well, I am coming to you from my front porch on this beautiful fall day and I am continuing to work on my little, I call it my plant nursery on my front porch, trying to get everything planted into the ground before it gets too cold. So today I'm excited about the plant that we're going to be planting and it's going to be absolutely beautiful and I can't wait to share it with you. So let me show you. So this is called the Seven Suns Flower or the Temple of Bloom. And here's the little tag right here. So when it first gets uh, in the spring, it gets these really pretty green leaves on it, which are just a beautiful, just a beautiful shade of green. And then it goes in the summertime in about August, it gets these pretty white blooms on it. And then as the white petals fall off, it leaves these bracts that are this pretty um, red color, kind of a pinky red color, if you can see right there. So this plant um, is gonna go in the front of our house and it's gonna be replacing our baby blue spruce. So we're sad about our baby blue spruce, but that's just one of the things in gardening, we just have to keep moving on. But let me show you guys the tag here. So here is the tag. So. If you're looking for a low maintenance plant, this is gonna be very well for your garden. And then it also, the pollinators love it. It is, just gives that beautiful fall interest color. It is like a medium resistant to deer. So we kinda will have to keep an eye on that because you know here we have lots of deer. And then it also, it needs um, well-drained soil and it gets six to 10 feet tall. So excited about getting this planted. When I looked at pictures of it online, it kind of reminds me of like a crepe myrtle, but maybe just a little more full and the texture of the leaves are definitely different. Okay, so let's just load up our little bucket here and we'll get our little kneeling pad and should be pretty quick and easy to get this done. Our pumpkins are still looking nice and cute on our front porch. Okay, so you can see we're on the right side of our house and there is the baby blue spruce and it just started needle dropping and it has just not stopped. So I read up a lot on it and this was really just an experiment because this um, little evergreen here only goes down to zone seven and we are like 8a b so we were stretching it trying to get this to grow in our area and as you can tell it does not like it here so we're going to get this baby blue spruce pulled up and then we'll get our temple of bloom planted but i think it's going to look really pretty right here in front of the house it can get nice and tall it has lots of space to spread out and it'll be kind of like a nice little focal point for this area was so deep we had to dig it out there's not a lot of soil here so we're gonna add in some compost planted in here 
and we added in some compost and some biotone and I tried to make sure that it was high so it's just not sitting down in a hole and so I think it's gonna look really good right here okay so that's gonna do it for today so it was nice and quick and easy it was sad to pull out that baby blue spruce but at least we kind of know what was going on with it so that makes me feel a little bit better and we can learn from those mistakes but I am so excited about giving getting this temple a bloom into the ground I think that is gonna be so beautiful I hope it does well here we'll keep an eye on it and make sure it likes where it's at but it's gonna be stunning here in our front garden so I have to do a little chores you can see I still have all this mess behind me here so hopefully we can get all this cleaned up and I need to get some watering done but I hope you guys found some inspiration in this and if you are looking for that unusual plant you know different than your crepe myrtle why don't you try out the seven suns temple of bloom and let me know if you've already planted planted it or if you would like to plant it in your garden and we could talk about it in the comments down below I hope you guys have a chance to get in your gardens today bye friends mm -hmm.